Hi guys, this video will be unusual, not as always. Those friends that follow me on Twitter already know that I was diagnosed with Lyme disease. Do not look on my happy face. I'm trying to hold on just and be brave, but once I was diagnosed I was in shock and did not sleep well. It was happened back then while I visited my mom and grandma in Kaminskoye. The purpose of my visit of Dnipro region was my grandma's birthday. This lady is 85 years old. My grandma doesn't celebrate her birthday, she hates it. But me and my mom decided to surprise her with my visit. If you want to see more about my trip to small industrial town, I will leave link to description to this video for another footage. I really blessed to have my grandma alive and sane at this age and breaks my heart to see how she going through the war. After having a birthday breakfast, I decided to meet my friend Julia and visit local park situated on the left bank that are surrounded with the forest and lakes. We were standing on the grass doing some pictures and I suddenly felt a bite. I reacted immediately and threw away this thing that bite me. I even did not realize who it was. Next day I went to Dnipro to see my colleague and forget about this bite, but in the evening I started to feel ache in my leg. My leg became red, itchy, aching and bruised. Last summer I was hiking and I was also bitten. I scratched it and put bacterial infection caused with Staphylococcus. And I remember it's very good because I was hospitalized. And thinking about this that it might be my previous experience, I bought antibiotics. Good or bad thing about Ukraine that you can actually reach pharmacy and buy any antibiotics you need without prescription. Sometimes it can play bad joke with you because you are taking unknown antibiotics without knowing what you are doing. But in my case I bought exactly that pills that I was prescribed last summer and immediately start to take it. For the next few days I've noticed improvement and forgot about for a while, but seven days passed and big erythema appeared on my leg. Actually, I was scared and thought what doctor can help me. It was Sunday and really no one worked. Good thing about Ukrainian medical system that even now, despite of the war, you can reach doctor and be exempt anytime you need or the next day maximum. So, despite it was Sunday, I went to strictly to emergency office of virologist department of state clinic and doctor exempt me in an hour. And this is really a privilege. Some immigrants that live in Ukraine for Canada or USA come to Ukraine specifically for health tourism. They are visiting a lot of doctors doing like dental care because here is cheaper and here is available. So once I showed doctor my leg, she said, it's not Staphylococcus. Girl, I think you have a tick bite and you should be tested for Lyme disease. But when I left the doctor's office, I thought, no chance it can be Lyme disease because my erythema is not typical. I have seen dozens of photos in the internet and mine doesn't look like that. And once I got my results, I was in disbelief. You can see them here. Normal is less than one and I have EGM 1.6 and EGG 1.9. So doctor said obviously it's Borreliosis. Doctor insisted I need to be tested on Western blood method. This analysis show your humoral immune response in Lyme Borreliosis and it used as additional confirmation and shows what stage of Borreliosis do you have. Now I need to take long course of antibiotic to make my body clean and to cure 
my disease and cast away bacteria. And by the way, doctor said that it was good that I bought antibiotics. The next day I was bitten. It was a luck. Of course, I've done my own research in the internet that dedicated to this disease and found out that this very dangerous disease and its dangers is in the symptoms because first stage passes almost without symptoms and people do not notice it. And after the second stage turns into the mess. Borrelia attacks all organs in your body and turns to autoimmune disease. Disease does not look on your status. It can affect everyone. Even celebrity have it, such as Yolanda Hadid, Justin Bieber, Bella Hadid and me. But I'm not celebrity and re really guys, I'm really scared and terrified and hope that antibiotics and Jesus will cure me. Sometimes our sorrows makes us closer to God. Now I'm visiting church more often and praying about healing. I have watched also a lot of videos in YouTube that made by people who already conquered this disease and they all telling one thing that except of virologists you need to visit neurologists that I also have done because disease can affect your brain and affect your nervous system and bring insomnia, anxiety, panic attacks, of, uh, numbing of the hands, legs and crumbling and other strange things. Guys, please be careful while you spend time outdoors because I want you to be healthy and happy. Wear long and light clothing that covers your legs and hands because it will be much easier to notice ticks. Use repellents to protect your body from the tick bite. Proceed with self-check on ticks when you came from hiking or outdoor walks. If you noticed any suspicious erythema on your body, please urge yourself to your doctor. As sooner you will start your treatment as better. Guys, thank you for watching this video till the very very end. I hope it was not so boring. I really hope that my body soon will be clean from this infection and all people who are suffering from Lyme berylliosis will find treatment. Jesus will heal them together with medication. If you're willing to support Jane as content creator, I will leave PayPal to description to this video and link to buy me a coffee site. Thank you and God be with you.